Hey everyone, welcome to a brand new video here on the channel. Today we're back with Final Fantasy VII Rebirth as we get to the Sanctum of Planetology. Do me a favor, go ahead and press that like button. Don't forget to subscribe, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Alright, now that we've rested, we can try to figure out how to get to this other stuff. Gotta be something... all this. Let's see. And we haven't really explored this way at all. Really this isn't all just open for nothing, right? Maybe. Oh. We found another chocobo stop. Let's get it. Okay, that chocobo stop is complete. Alright, so now... Let's go back over this way. So we know that... Oh wait, no, that one doesn't go to the tower. What's this one go to? Okay, so we got a couple here, actually. Let's see where they lead. Well, this leads over here. Oh, is that thing down there? That might be down there. What does this lead to? Okay, that don't go anywhere. So just this. This doesn't really lead to anything except this. Which I'm guessing this is to get all the way over there. Which looks like we need to get to. So we're good with this. Yeah, this is going to get us to the wellspring. Okay. And then we're just going to get back down to get to that, uh... Titan thing. Pick up all the things. Okay. Let's activate this wellspring. Bink. Bink. And bink. This should give me access to the classified intel. I think. That gets us the, uh, you must slay it. classified intel. Oh, it's way down there. Okay. Alright. Get back on this and try to make our way down. Twish. Wait. Is there anything else this way? Before I just dip. Oh yeah, this goes somewhere. 
Oh, this goes to the elevator. Okay. We don't need to get there yet. Oh, I don't think we can go down that other way, now that I think about it. I think we have to go down this way. Fair enough. We want to go back this way anyway. To get to the... Shrine. Or sanctuary, that's what they're called. I couldn't remember. Alright, let's press on this. Yes. Analyze it. Analyze it all. Okay. Oh, complicated. X square triangle. XX square triangle X. This may take me a couple times. X square triangle. XX square triangle X. Okay. X square triangle X X square triangle X. Hey, I got it one shot. Holy. My brain is on fire today. Okay, that's completed. The thing that concerns me is it still shows we have five. But I don't know where anything else is. I must confess I have reservations about making Bahamut arisen any stronger. I cannot decide if this development is positive or terrifying. Ah, can it be you both? Yet to obtain the requisite materia, as I recall, you'll first need to confront the divine via the combat simulator. Okay, so that's complete. Now, yeah, there's nothing... Oh, there's a whole other place over here, though. Which we probably have to do this quest to get to. But I don't know. Looks like all mountains. It's got to be something, right? But I guess for now, we'll try to get to this quest... I'm thinking maybe that elevator we saw. What's this? Baboa wood. Ground level gate. Okay, yeah. Hey, come on. I'm trying to get up here to get these things, peoples. Getting in my way. I'm sorry, but the elevator is currently undergoing maintenance. Oh, okay. But there's stairs. If I can stop ho hopping over that railing. I don't know, the stairs don't go nowhere. Well, that's a dead end. So let's see. How else can we get up there? Gotta be something here. Oh, here maybe? No. Hmm. There's no wind things to climb up there. We gotta figure out how to get up there. Okay. Okay, so we had to fast travel to training course number two, which puts us right here. Get on the chocobo and go away. We haven't gone. Oops, I guess we're fighting. Yeah. <laughs> 
guess it's inevitable. Unavoidable. Brace yourself. You're done. Oh, that's all of them. Okay. So. Back to going this way. You said old Sephiroth's come back from the dead, right? And that that's a bad thing. So, what I want to know is, how do he do it? And what's he after? He wants to save the planet. But... Wouldn't that make him a good guy? It's not what he's doing, but how. He doesn't give a shit. Oh, nope, no, we're fighting. Continue up. I don't know if it's worth calling the Chocobo. I guess it is. Behold the Cosmo Canyon, a sacred sanctuary where the planet's greatest minds gather. It's beautiful. More than I ever imagined. Come on, let's pick up the base. I can hear it calling my name. Yeah, okay. me too. Go way down here. Aha, here's the bridge. Okay. Bogan Hagen? Uh, you can let them through. They're good people. I promise. After all, they're the reason I'm here. What in the hell was that? Hey guys, it's me. Who? <laughs> He's such a softie. Real quick. Gotta check something. An airship dropped these on us this morning. Wanted posters of the terrorists oh, yeah. who bombed those reactors. Hmm. Huh. But I think we can say you had nothing to do with all that. Even if Nanaki hadn't vouched for you, it's obvious. Welcome to the Sanctum of Planetology, Cosmo Canyon. This looks like a big place. You see that wanted poster? Pictures look nothing like us. Must be that way for a reason. Gotta keep on our toes. So we're going this way. Maybe, maybe not. Hmm. Is there a way to go up? I don't really know. I guess we're just exploring until we figure it out. This is a dining area. There's plenty of stuff here. Welcome to 
But I'm not exactly sure how to get to where we're supposed to go. I need to find a way that goes up somewhere. I don't think any of this is it. I guess we might as well get it explored. Fellow Bugenhagen has forbidden anyone from entering. Okay, so we can't go that way. Good to know. Ah, there's stairs. What kind of ceremony do you Maybe this is where we need to go. shops are. I can at least check those out when I'm done. There we go. I was born and raised here, in this canyon. I was to become a watcher of the veil like those before me, until I was taken by Shinra. Now that I'm home, and have repaid my debt to you, I plan to serve my village once more. I appreciate all that you've done for me. Thank you. Well, okay. I'm really gonna miss you, Red. Oh, don't say that. You're only making this harder. I mean, I wish we had more time, but this is my duty. I suppose it was your duty to act the old man. I wanted you to treat me as an equal, not a dog. Not a pig! Is that you, my boy? Coming! <laughs> so, was that goodbye? Nah, I'm sure we'll see him around the canyon. The real question is, why'd we come here? To learn the secrets of planetology. Come on. Can't forget that materia. As for me. Ah, that will do. A little cat I'm now. some shot eye if you don't mind. Then we can see the sights. Okay. It's taking an elevator. Okay. Lift your gaze to the We yearn to chase the horizon. Since time in the book. Old. Let us go see what Red is up to. Or the kitty? Is that what it? I don't know. Oh, wow, this goes way up. Why didn't we just about catch up to him? And then suddenly we didn't. Oh, oh look at that old man. He's on a ball. Nanaki. 
My name is Wolkenhagen. I teach planetology here in the canyon. One could say I know a thing or two about our world. A thing or two? I doubt there's a thing or two you don't know about it. <laughs> well, it might seem that way to a child like yourself. I'm not a child anymore. I'm 48. 40 what? <laughs> <laughs> Nanaki here has a long life ahead of him. In human terms, I would say he's about 15 or 16 years old. That's more than old enough. I can protect our Vale and everyone in it. Which is more than I can say for my good-for-nothing father. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Speaking of the members of our little community, have you announced your return to one and all, Namaki? One and all? Not yet. Be right back. Hmm. <laughs> but where are my manners? Please, come in and have a look around. Okay. <laughs> devices piqued your curiosity they are essential to my studies of the planet hmm. so what am I doing other than snooping ah That little scamp. I'll have you know that in his childhood, Nanaki was quite a handful. Okay. I can only assume I need to keep going up. Because it's not really giving me. Ooh. Okay. There's the next thing. Oh, oh, oh. You won't find a larger telescope on the planet. With it, you can see to the edge of the galaxy. There's no better view of the stars than through this scope. But the lens could do with some cleaning. My apologies. Okay. Nothing there. So what am I looking for now? Now am I going back down? I guess so. I don't see anything else up here. I also don't exactly see how to get down. How lost can I get? Okay, there we go. What is that again? This tubing hmm. allows us on the surface to hear the inner voice of the planet. What we just heard didn't come from the planet, though. That was definitely the voice of a weapon. Hmm. You seem awfully sure of yourself, miss. Because we saw them, with our own eyes. Two, in the Corral and Gungaga reactors. They were loud and huge. <laughs> 
fascinating account. Were it true? He just called you a liar. Such grand delusions could be a sign of Marco poisoning. Do see a doctor. Um, excuse me? Oh, oh. Yes. That would do them some good. <laughs> Judging from everything you've said, I called you the Lulu. The three of you are unfamiliar with basic planetology. But it is never too late to learn. Please, come with me. Oh no. It's making us go slow. The slow walk of doom. I present to you our planetarium. While the Shinra building features the latest iteration, this particular one is my original design. Now then, without further ado. Bum, 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 bum. That's pretty. Wow. <laughs> this is only the beginning. A shooting star. Planetology is not simply the study of the cosmos and the celestial bodies that dwell in it. Rather, it is a quest to comprehend the cyclical nature of life. Hmm. Behold, the planet we call home. It was from its soil, so teeming with life, that mankind was born. And like all living things, man is fated to die. So, what happens next? The body wanders and returns to the planet. But what of the mind, the spirit, the soul? Much like its former vessel, it too returns whence it came. To the great river where all intertwine and circle the planet without end. A cycle of continuous convergence and divergence. The ceaseless ebb and flow that is the life stream. An apt name, though it is as much a reservoir as it is a stream, being the sum of the planet's spiritual energy. It is the very essence of our star. The blood coursing through its planetary veins. And okay. If ever that essence were to be entirely depleted. It would just crumble. Interesting. Of course, these are but basic principles of planetology. So you're saying that Mako is spiritual energy, which we're using up? Just so. Siphoned from the planet and processed for industry. That energy can no longer fulfill its true purpose. It is fated to fuel man's machinery, then fade away. Okay, but does it actually fade away? I mean, what if it doesn't? 
What if it just returns to the life stream in a different form? Is that possible? A novel theory. Suggestive Sounds of a like a... Uh... Understanding. Hmm. However, that can be overcome She's real hopeful. with time and education. You rang? Please escort this young lady to our seminar room, would you? Right this way. Okay. Hey, can I come? Hmm. Content creation streaming live from the spaceship Alien brain waves and kills makes the face hit I am Nazi Nation pushing music out the basement I've been sent to Earth to get this Twitch game a facelift Content creation streaming live from the spaceship Alien brain waves and kills makes the face hit These kids are like dark water, get good or get slaughtered I'm feeling a bit bothered with 